provare a vincere ovviamente l'ESL Master in Giappone. Provare a vincere in Giappone l'ESL. The advantage of the mid, Maru going for a bit of a sneaky play, tries to get onto Kuru, but he just flies up into the air, tanking a good amount of shots. It is Kenji Aba duking out in a mechanics war against Joker. Will he get the skill? Kuru gets this one, 95 to 93% right now. It is Helmi on reply to him. Achabi, 99, 97%, 98, 99%, 90. No way! No way! That push is kind of really being shut down right now. Uh, Kenji with a nice step, but he does fall to the nest egg. A bit unfortunate misstep there from the Piper, and Maru just rolls across straight to the base, but it looks like Achapi, he's completely abandoned the defense. He's trying to go for all in, 70%. Kenji, he actually defends it somehow against all odds. They defend against the Darrow, and it is Helmi who is instead inside the base. Helmi somehow against all odds. Kenji missing a critical shot right now. Another rocket loses you just to secure a little bit of time. Maru rolls in onto the base right now and actually secures a game. Help me again with the mid control. Try to ultimate the lead, but help me. Did it already. Can they repeat what they just did in the first match? up pushing now a jumpy out of gadgets has to use it super to come in clutch here trying to get the kill trying to get some damage five seconds left on the clock and with that reply totem takes this second set and the world championship pin comes into play kenji jumping onto the middle Forcing Joker into the left side. Joker, he walls himself in though, being able to save himself here. However, the stars lead are still indeed in help me help help me's favor. 10 seconds on the clock, Sunny. I don't think there's much that can be done right now. A last push coming in here from Totem. Cookie Papa comes out. Kenji, he does come in. He trades out a kill, takes away the pressure. And eight to seven stars. Help me take game number one. Capsulate his old team. Kenji does get a kill on the other side. He's falling as well. Three to five stars. Wall is coming down. Jokers. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! No way! No way! Stay on lane for now. Trying to go up against the Chappie. Chappie knows they need to take down onto Joker. They need some control over mid. They need something to still turn this game around. Yep, Kenji, however, coming up there with that super is going to be able to delete half of Totem's roster immediately. But Mari, he strikes back. Did help me overcommit. It was a nice play coming out there, but the follow up, it didn't really seem good enough. 11 seconds left on the clock, and help me needs the kill onto either Choker or Mari. Both will be enough to get this win. Choker gets his super. It's going to be hard to take him down. Mari is going to be the goal. Totem, they are going to be securing the 10th gem and looking at the way things are going, Sunny. I don't like this, but I think, help me, are unfortunately going to be giving this one up to reply, Totem. 50 seconds left for someone to make a move, otherwise it goes into OT. And we just know Maru is going to be feasting once those walls break down. But it's only a tribe let it go that long. Zulon already stuffed back Maru with a pass. Oh. It's an easy walk in. No, a oh. tank there as Libby has the ball. A little bounce pass out. Will there be enough time to respawn? Zulon with the robotic rats down. Maru walks it in. And it's a win for Reply Totem. I'm counting that timer there. 34 seconds. We're already at a 1-1 scoreline. Tribe Gaming NA gotta slow down the pace of this match, though. If they don't want to get pummeled on the right side, pass up to Maru. Gonna be super in. Oh. Using the suplex supplement and an easy one right down the middle. Reply Totem with the response. It's brute. Joker's gonna get hit as well, but Mori's looking for that gem. Can't quite find it just yet. Has to wait a little bit longer. Joker's sliding in for now. Tyron needs to pinch into that mid, but actually focusing too hard in his lane. 10 to 10. Even Stevens as Tribe Gaming NA get jumped on and Maru's Ooh. taken down. That could be a control loss. Joker's low as well. Slowed. Everybody's falling. And it's a massive gem drop as now he's the 11 to 10 and control to Tribe. Remarkably, still enough time for Reply Totem to start bringing things back. Just a couple of gems need to drop on this floor, and there will be enough time unless one of these gets recovered by Tribe Gaming NA, or we see an important kill. Down goes Maori. Joker's got to clutch it up. He just might be able to. He just needs one more gem. He's going to go for it. And the interruption, and he gets away with it. He can't keep getting away with it. Where are the rest of the gems? It's 13 to 11. Did he take some with him? 14 to 10, Joker's absolutely robbed and blind. Six seconds, I didn't even see the gems being taken, but he survives it out and reply to to win it. Now he's trying to slow things down, bit of turret v turret action on the left side, easy takedown for Tyrant, however. I would say the most likely to fall first is his Livy because Joker is going insane on the sprout. He has all day, he's already forcing Zulon out of position. 
Yeah, I mean, Zulan's blocked in. In comes Mori as well. Drop the base needs to be used, but it can't use it just yet. Esplavi's going to be low. Zulan's low as well, but we see a trade come out as Totem are going to be down to two men just the same as Tribe. 3k hits. Esplavi might be able to find it, but no! The gas takes him, and Totem take the game. Tribe Gaming and A still managing to hold things back. Joker and Mauru both really with their backs against the wall. Poison, rather, as they are now forced to move forward into the super. The last call from his Livia just might be if they're able to finish strong here. Mauru tries to get that victory oh. on the right side. He just might be able to as Livy falls. Reply, Totem, get the win. Totem sweeps in A. Joker Maru just defending Spoon. Why? Maru just looks absolutely terrified. He's been hovering around this middle area. Joker finally now going on an aggressive play. One roll, tries to get Ramoya. He doesn't really get a finish him on right now. He actually leaves him alive. I'm not sure if that's the best idea. Just going on the save right now. They've still got 50 seconds left on the clock. This preemptive strike now cycling up the turret. But Crazy Raccoon, they hold. Jesse Turret is there, but sadly he wasn't able to press his gadget in time. Doesn't do as much damage as they were hoping for. Reply Totem regardless in the lead here. 13% left. Maru and Maori both on safe. This could be over here. They make it. Now it's the Totem Show. Turret's flying in with that gadget. It's an insane amount of damage. The RT not really enough to defend right now. See the tempo, he played so well, but what does it matter when the thrusts and the tanks are banging on your safe? It's shielded by Maori. What a play here. Joker gets out of that situation, getting a super himself. They're still both alive. What is going on? Joker, Maori, both just unkillable right now. Joker finally falling. Maori in a 1v3. This is going to be crazy. Raccoon taking this. Maori and Joker now pushing. Moya, he picked up the gems. The Tensai just lost. And Joker with the next gem. They only need one more to start another countdown here. Uncharacteristic mistake coming out there from Tensai not popping off his blow, his, his blow, his lamp blow on right immediately after the pull, but that does give Joker one of the most highlight worthy plays of the entire tournament. When have you ever seen a Max get pulled and survive, and not just survive, but take out the entire team and just like that, Reply Totem are going to be taking, leading this set 2-0. to zero. Still not able to pick up that last one, going in aggressively against Shititan Pomoya and Tensai, all in mid, shooting at him, he gets out of there. They need to kill onto him. They have 11 seconds, will they make it? Tensai gets the kill there. Amazing kind of stuff coming out of it from Crazy Raccoon, but oh no, tragedy strikes onto them once again. Tensai, his balls this game seem absolutely cursed because every time he does it, he just seems to drop every single gem in his pocket. It doesn't matter how much they can do, but when your balls are working in your favor, that is what happens. And Totem right now, they are being pushed back in the base. A reset comes out from Crazy Raccoon. Do you think they can make it, Sunny? Maori was a jump jumping into Sitte Dampo, finally falling again. We are in 11 seconds. They need to kill this time around Joker. Sitte with the shots onto him is alone there. Not able to take him down, is he? Slept on the clock. Is there even going to be a goal? Totem with the potentially lost push here. Joker is low though. 15 seconds now. Maori and Joker both are so, so low. Getting hit by Moyo. Super great. Super. Is the pass gonna happen here in time? Shit, the Tampa passing to Tensai. Super is coming, and this is the goal! Four seconds! Being pushed back all the way into spawn. Maru with a Shelly into Lola. Doesn't work out quite as he imagined. Crazy Raccoon with an opportunity to score if they get another takedown reply. Totem all the way into spawn. Tensai right now holding strong in the center. Maru pushing up here into the Bali. He is between a, a wall and a half place now. Forced to rotate towards Joker. But look at the right side. It is Maru actually landing a critical stun on the Shinde Tampo right now. And the ball flies out. The coordination is absolutely perfect. And Totem, they take one mistake and they take it all the way. Tensai right now already being pushed back a little bit by Maru. And Joker right now, he's the one that's in control of the mid. Pushing, pushing back Tensai. Maru gets the stun as well. Everything is just blown apart for Crazy Raccoon, it's an open goal! The game already, if they just kept the ball, they decided not to, and now Crazy Raccoon has another chance. 40 seconds before the end here to push up the mat. 
map and potentially make a score here. Tensai goes down. Moya is still standing. What a defense from that Dynamite. Imagine winning with a Dynamite against Crazy Raccoon. Imagine Dynamite on defense. A brawler that doesn't make any sense when it comes to it. But when you land every single shot in the game, any brawler looks good. And Maru, right, Maru, right now, he's certainly looking at one of the best players in the world. Only 10 seconds left, Sane. Joker on defense, Mario Maru coming out of spawn. Crazy Raccoon with the last potential push up here. Tensai falling, Moya one shot, two seconds left and it's gonna be replied Totem winning against Crazy Raccoon. Moving on into the Grand Finals. If you look at the latest results, for example, Worlds or last year Worlds, the Japanese have been dominating the scene, but I think we can definitely have a chance this year and try to beat them. <laughs> I hope you guys are prepared because this year is gonna be Europe's year. Single percentage so far captured by Tribe Gaming in A, and each and every one of them is trying to be the very first one to step on one of these circles, but it's just not happening. Zuan looks to pinch things in on the right side versus Maori. They're out of luck on the left side. Maori taken down over here, but Maori has so much help despite all of the fire that his Livy and Zuan have to offer. It's just not enough to take these guys down and reply totem 100 to 0% on game number two. Well, Maori on the right side is capturing just a little bit, making sure that he doesn't get too aggressive, not wasting any energy there on the right side. So he is able to farm up a super along the way. Does have one in on the left side as Livy Zulon just trying to get this last bit of capture percentage. The slow on to Mauru is a guaranteed victory. Tribe Gaming, Joker needs to hit some shots out here, but Tyrant's juking him so, so hard. Mauru on the right side doing his best, but it isn't enough. Tribe Gaming in a, they take back the momentum and they take set number one. 1v3 and he's taken down whilst trying to transform as well. Tribe Gaming in a, continue their win streak to make it four and take the first game. He doesn't quite get the takedown is still able to get the anti-heal onto Zuan. Very, very aggressive play from Tyrant. Joker's not able to close in in enough range. Joker also exploding out, but the knockback isn't enough to keep him alive. And Tribe Gaming and A get to run away with 10 gems. 10 seconds remain, and Reply Totem has no positioning to get rid of them. Tribe Gaming, they're safe and sound, and they post up a second game on the board. Maru taking a lot of damage. Here it comes. Gotta see the Mama squeeze damage. Maru does get some shots in. Joker finishes it off. This is not a good situation for Tribe Gaming and A. Reply Totem pick up the next gem most likely and start that countdown. Yeah, Maori down the left hand side has to be cautious, but Edwin is very low. Can't really make an aggressive push, but Reply Totem have to remain in the mid. Tyrant very low and it's all down to Zulan as we see him drop down the bottom as well as Libby. He's round the back for four seconds on the clock and Reply Totem, they might be doing a try back to them. A few more gems for Reply Totem to start the countdown and now that trickles down to one. I mean, Zulan just ate absolutely everything. We need to see a gem carrier form the side of Reply Totem. If Tribe wants to stand a chance, Maru's gonna be there to get the damage in, but I don't think Zulan can get the finish. As will be sliding down the left hand side and actually gonna be flying hook in. Doesn't get the kill, maybe a little bit premature maybe too aggressive and now Reply Totem are going to be taking this one home 2-2 in gem grab gem fort and Reply Totem fought back strongly to bring it to where it is now but actually now going in Tyrant's going to go down and it's actually Maru going to claim all of the gems take them back to Reply Totem side does actually have the answer got the spin on top of him and can't get the reset just yet do the shots find it they don't but still 10 seconds it could be possible as Livy needs to stay alive on the right side. He does have a super in, but no health. Tyrant continues to push things in on the right side. Zulon trying to do whatever he can, but he's just out of range. And Reply Totem managed to take back the entire set. Now 25 seconds on the clock, Penny Mortar to place back, so they can't take it out no matter what. They've got to get up, they've got to get damage, but Reply Totem are defending well. Enemy number one is a clock right here, just 6% differential as we now dip into the countdown. Joker on the right side, ready to jump in at any moment should he get that super. Zulon and Zulon both trying to keep their distance. It's go time. Five seconds left as Livy has to have something. A jump in from Joker could seal the deal. Two seconds remain and not a single whisper from Tribe Gaming in A on Reply Totem safe. It's going to be a huge thorn in the side for Tribe Gaming in A. They have to dedicate two brawlers to take him down. Should he get that super, it's going to be extra troublesome. Maru almost even getting the takedown onto Tyrant as Livy also on the right side. Now jumping forward, taking the aggro approach. Maori and immediately punishes that and looks to finish things off with Rocket Rain down from the right side. Just a single jump in, a single super in for Maori could do it. There's the jump from Joker and they take set number three. It's not looking good. 7,000 HP Sprout here as well, but there is a pathway through. Tyrant needs a super. Eslivy needs something, anything to make this happen. TP to the left hand side, spins there as well. The wall on the right side locks them out. The knock, the shots. Tyrant can't get it done in time. He does. Oh! 16 
to 15. A try and take it. 20 seconds left. Tribe Gaming and A have to heal up before this final push in. I mean, it's going to take everything Reply Totem have got and more. But as Libby's there, TP in from him, not going to drop his legs just yet. Now needs to do it to tank. In comes Zulan. He doesn't even get the kill on Maori. Tyrant's got something to say about it, but it's not enough. We're going to see a match point for Reply Totem up next. Try gaming one away from set number five. He's right on top of Maru. Here comes the super in. Maori also could be taken down. It's a comeback for Tribe Gaming in A. How is he going to get out of there? He has no super. The dodges come in. Maori needs to be shut down. He's out of range. A takedown for Tribe Gaming in A as they run back with a countdown. Tyron, the absolute beast, coming in clutch for Tribe Gaming once more. He did it in the second. He's doing it in the fifth. Here he is. Spin as well. Super dropped on top of him, but they're too far. Far ahead, set number five. Here we come. Left on the clock. Joker has the super. As Livy almost taken down, they're almost completely zoned out of their own spawn. But they do manage to push forward. Tyrant is holding two lanes at once on the left side. Five seconds left. Do we see all of these walls break down? And perhaps it's goal scoring opportunity for Reply Totem. Tyrant keeping drive in this one. They're not able to avoid a couple of those curveballs, though, and that's going to give control to Totem. They're starting to aggress. Joker's got the 3k. He's got the kill. He's got the slow. The stick around comes in. Tyrant falls. Ezlivy falls. And Joker extends the lead to two. The biggest enemy right now is the lack of visibility of their enemy. Reply Totem know this so, so well. They're keeping Joker on that mid area. Maori now around the right side can receive the pass. Just 15 seconds left. Reply Totem beating out the clock. An easy goal into the left side. And only only if Tribe Gaming and A can bring this back in the last 10 seconds, can they stop this domination? This is gonna be it. No chance of a Tribe victory. They remain the eternal second and Reply Totem add another first place to their tally and a crown the Snapdragon Mobile Masters Champions. Say hello everyone to your Snapdragon Mobile Masters Champions. Do you feel Joker? Yeah, we're <laughs>